Ah, that's good, Joe. Sir, we have the package you have requested. Just set it down over there. Fragile. What do you think that means? It must be Italian. Colson, status report. Energy levels are at 300%. So, sir, was that really necessary? It was entirely necessary. Where the heck did he come from? He must have opened a portal from his dimension and transmitted himself directly into our base. Uh, actually, I took the subway, but that sounds cooler, so let's go with that. Foolish mortal. Man, they are getting killed out there! Somebody better go help him. I'm okay. Ooh, shiny. Stop right there. Uh, look! A distraction! Where? <laughs> Stupid idiots. Attention all S.H.I.E.L.D. agents. This is a Code Red situation. I repeat, a Code Red situation. For all of you who didn't hear me the first two times, I repeat again. This is a Code Red situation. Aw, oh, sweet! That means free donuts in the break room. No, man, that's a Code Blue. Dang it. He's coming! Any of you fine gentlemen mind telling me where the hangar is? Sure, just go down the hall, take a left, and the door should be straight ahead. Much appreciated. Man, this place is full of idiots. What a nice guy. Yeah, but his hat was weird, though. I told you not to leave the keys in your car. Uh, that was your car. What? What now, sir? We're gonna have to call in the Avengers. All right, Avengers. Roll call. Cap. Here. Thor. Present. Hulk. I have a name, you know. Yeah, whatever. The other two. We're important, too. Uh-huh. Well, guess that's it. Wait a minute. Where's Stark? Hey guys, sorry I'm late. My meeting with the president ran a little long and then I had to go refuel my private jet over on my own personal island. Not before, of course, donating $500,000 to my local charity, because, you know, boredom. And now I'm here. So what I miss? Gee, Stark, how badly do you want us to punch you? Okay, okay, I might have lied about the private jet. It was a private helicopter. I had a bike once. My mom ran it over when she was backing out of the driveway, though. Wow, Hawkeye. You know, I don't approve of people bragging about themselves. But you just- I don't want to hear it. Are you girls done yet? Because I have a mission I'd like to tell you about that kind of involves the fate of the world. I'm all ears. Our security cameras have picked up what we think is Loki traveling in the public area. He appears to be hiding in plain sight, dressing in civilian clothes rather than his usual as guardian outfit. You might say he's playing it pretty low-key. Shut up, Hawkeye. I'm the funny one. And by funny, do you mean self-absorbed, overly ambitious, and an overall jerk in general? At least I didn't purposely crash a plane into an iceberg so I could live another hundred years. I did not intend for that to happen. Is that what you tell the graves of your once so-called friends? As I was saying, you are to retrieve the Cosmic Cube from Loki at all costs. Evacuate any civilians if necessary. I say, when I first lay eyes upon Loki, I shall best him with the power of Mjolnir. Gesundheit. What is this tight gazun you speak of? You said you were going to beat Loki with what now? Mjolnir, my mighty hammer. Well, why didn't you just say that? It's a lot better than Mew Mew, or whatever that stupid name was. Are you insulting me, Stark? Stark is the insulting type. 
Well, okay then, star-spangled citizen. Why don't you give me some lessons in perfect personalities? Why oh, yeah, should I rip thy nose jerk off and throw it into the Would you all just stop arguing for two seconds? Does anyone have any questions? I have one. Why is that man playing Space Invaders? What? That guy right over there. He's playing Space Invaders. You know, the video game? Hey man, I don't have a choice. It's just a sticker. That's what they all say, buddy. Whatever, Stark. Just get out there and stop Loki. Avengers, assemble! We're all right here, you know. The Avengers will never recognize me in these clothes. I will blend perfectly into the crowd of bystanders around me. Uh, hey man, were you just talking to yourself? Silence, mortal! All who oppose me must die! Did did you just fall out of the sky? That's beside the point. Just stand down and no one gets hurt. Alright, just let me climb over this- th Oh my gosh! Yeah, you know what? Just, just go on without me. I'm good down here. Goodbye, Captain. Sorry I'm late. I was trying to figure out what the coolest looking entrance would be. I think I nailed it, am I right? No! I will not be beaten by a group of super freaks! Aw oh, man, I love that song! Now you will feel my wrath! Well, I guess we can add spontaneous wardrobe changes to Loki's list of powers. Let go of me! As you wish. Ah! I've always wanted to do that. Ah! Uh, <clears throat> Yeah. Ow. Brother, what be this madness? If I cannot rule Asgard, then I shall take my rightful place as king of these puny mortals. I say thee nay. Dude, what are they talking about? I dunno, but I got five bucks on the guy with the pointy helmet. You're on. Now you will feel the might of Mjolnir! What was that supposed to- Wait for it? Ten bucks says I can lift it. I'd like to see you try. <coughs> Looks like it's time to pay up. <coughs> what the- <coughs> Ah, uh, <clears throat> Coulson, what did I tell you about spontaneously flying into the break room? Sorry, sir. Aha! Now you shall die! So, does Loki's weapon have a ridiculously hard to pronounce name as well? Nay, it'd be just a staff. We could call it the mystical twiddle stick, with a silent cue at the end. That is the stupidest thing I've ever heard. The wary wand of wisdom? He's getting away! Goodbye, Avengers. <gasps> I hate all of you. So, Loki, how's it feel to be captured by a group of super freaks? 
Save this moment, Fury. When I escape from here, I will crush you under my boot like the small insect you are. That's some big talk for a man dressed in a Halloween costume. At least I'm not wearing an eye patch. Which looks cooler, giant horned helmet or an eye patch? I'll give you some time to think it over. God knows you have enough of it. Man, I hate that guy. Heard that. Hey, Captain America. Can I call you Cap? No. Ha, I'm just kidding. Oh, well, I'm a big fan, and I was just wondering if you would like to sign my limited edition trading cards. Whoa, is that me? Yup, people will buy anything with your face on it. Wow, next thing you know, they're going to turn me into a tiny plastic figurine. Hello there, Bruce. What do you want, you piece of dirt? Now, now, a little feisty there, aren't we? I could crush you right now and not even give a second thought. Oh, it's not me you want to crush. What? I was talking to Thor this one time, and he said you smell like... Well, I won't go into detail. How stupid do you think I am? You didn't hear it from me. Stark said those pants make your butt look big. What? And that waffle you left in the fridge yesterday? He's eating it as we speak. Why, that little... Heh, <laughs> so then, after he dropped the cow on top of my house, I took his toilet and put it... Stark? Oh no, is this about me deleting the Hobbit from the DVR? Cause see, Game of Thrones was on, and something had to go, cause we were like 97% full, and... And you... Bruce? Waffle? All right, then. This just got personal. Uh, thanks. Don't mention it. Captain! So, Cap, about those trading cards. I think they're saving the best for last. Excuse me. Yes? Would you please pass me that staff over there? Of course. Why, thank you. Wonder where he's going. Hey, we just found out that Loki has escaped. You seen him? <gasps> I'll be right back. I never understood that guy. My goal in life is to be the one nameless character who actually lives through the movie. Stop right there. Why should I listen to a puny mortal like you? Uh, because I have this? What exactly is that? I'm pretty sure it's a gun, but honestly I don't even know what it does. So you're threatening me with something you don't even know how to use? Oh, I know how to use it. You just pull the trigger like this. Huh. So that's what it does. No! Not... Not... Uh, what was his name again? I believe his name was Phil Coulson, sir. Not Phil Coulson! Now clean this up, it's disgusting.